Welcome to another quick bite episode with Getting Lost. Today, we're looking at vending machines. Vending machines, you say? Every country has vending machines. Yes, I know. But we are looking at unique vending machines in Singapore. Yes, in Singapore. I know. You wouldn't expect any many unique vending machines in Singapore. In Japan, yes, but not Singapore. So, let's see what we can find out. Okay, this is the this is the normal vending machines you have. Okay, as per usual, they serve canned drinks, water drinks, water. You know, and this is another version of it. But there's something different. There's the one beside it in red. Why is it in red? Because it's a fresh hot sandwich machine. A fresh hot sandwich vending machine. Yes, it makes fre fresh hot sandwiches 24 7 whenever you want to eat it. Ah, I know. And it's in 90 seconds. Yup. Wow. Okay, this one may not be too unique, you know. Serving drinks, now they serve foods. I'm sure there are also other vending machines I saw that actually serve snacks, you know. Where you can put in the money, get snacks, you know. But, you see this one? You accept cash and coins. That's per usual, I guess. Nothing very unique about this. Hopefully, the next one will be slightly more unique. which is a bread vending machine. So, if you are tired of going to the supermarket or your basic convenience store, you can come to this machine and get your bread. But then, unfortunately, they do not make a machine that can put, uh, have you make your own sandwiches. But, uh, this machine does sell you the bread for you to do it. Okay, other than the bread, there's also some buns, some cream buns, but aside, the cream buns here sucks. It doesn't taste nice because it's like either there's too much bread or the filling itself is like, tastes artificial. But what to do, when you're hungry, you eat what you have. And if you have a bread vending machine, you eat bread 24-7 Unless the machine is spoiled <laughs> But that's another issue Let's see what we have next Yes, this is a $2 per cup orange juice machine With a cute uh, a picture of a kawaii uh, Like a... You know, it's not touch screen Anyway, so if you are tired you know, or lazy to squeeze your own orange, you can pay $2 for this machine to squeeze it for you. And you can drink it. Yes, freshly squeezed orange. Look at that, all the oranges in there. And they accept coins and notes too. <laughs> so you have bread and orange, a good breakfast. Now, for something slightly different. When you have your bread, you know, and your orange juice, you need something to, you know, to read while you are having your breakfast. So you you just need to have this machine here that sells you magazines and newspapers. Yep, magazines and newspapers to read while you're eating your breakfast to catch up on current events and gossip, celeb celebrity gossips. Okay, this is another unique one. I do not know whether you have this in your country. The others you may have, but for this one you may not have. It's actually a machine that sells handphone accessories. So your basic handphone accessories are like your your handphone case, your stylus, your earphones, your headphones, you know, and also some cables. 
But only one thing I don't really understand about this is that this vending machine is actually in a shopping center. So shopping centers are not open 24-7. So why do you need a vending machine for this, you know? You might as well just have this in your in your shop. And there's also a temperature gauge. So that's your handphone accessories don't melt. I don't know. You never know. Maybe it's too hot to handle. <laughs> okay, and lastly, this. I think you may have all the others, but you may not have this. This, my friend, is what they call a gold ATM. Yes, this is an ATM here, but if you are selling something, you can buy something from it. I would think that it should be a vending machine. So, they actually sell gold or silver ingots. Yes, gold or silver ingots. And on the ingots, you have different design. You see, you can buy. So if you can buy something, that means that you, in theory, it's a vending machine, and you have all different designs. You can have uh, it in the animal zodiac. You can have it in um, Chinese words. Chinese characters, you know, but I do notice that everything is sold out. Yeah, so maybe it is an ATM machine since they can't sell anything since everything is sold out. But, you know, I still think it's a vending machine. I was actually really curious how much it costs, but then all of them are sold out. Thank you very much for joining me for this vending machine adventure. Yes, the vending machine adventure in Singapore. I know we will never have as many vending machines or as varied variety of vending machines as the mother country of vending machines in Japan, but we have some unique ones now in Singapore. I do not know whether you have this in your country. If you do, uh, write down on the comments below. Tell me about them. And I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you very much. Uh, for watching if you like this uh, please uh, click the subscribe button and click the thumbs up button to like it other than that in the future if I do find any more weird things in Singapore I will put it here for you to see but until next time until next time I hope you enjoyed yourself bye bye thank you for watching also